Hello and welcome to the Superbox training. Here you will learn how to download and get your box set up and ready to use. In this training, we will discuss where to find movies, where to find channels, where to find sports, and generally how to operate the box. Let's discuss the remote control. You have the home button and you will also come across the back button, which is very important. And don't forget the OK button in the center of the remote. All right, step one. The first screen you're going to see is a disclaimer notice. And it just basically goes through what the Superbox is and what the Superbox is. And you're going to accept. At the bottom of the left, you'll see a small gear. That is where the settings are. That's where you go and set the life plan. Now it's time to actually add an app. This disclaimer notice will automatically count down. And once it counts down, it's going to allow you to start adding apps. Now that you've made your selection, it's time to assign those sections to Blue TV, Blue BOD, and Playback. You're going to add BOD. You're going to add Blue VOD, which is Blue Video On Demand. At this point, you're able to add to your front screen. You can add some of the videos like YouTube. You can add the fast icon, which will tell you how fast the connection is. And you could also add playback. These add sections are for you to put apps so that you can easily find them. And remember those came from that apps section. In those add plus sections, you can add gallery. You can also add music, which means you can connect the USB and it will read that information from the, it does not mean it will play music from any station and it will not play anything on the gallery unless you have a USB with images on it. Now it's time to watch some TV. All right, now it's time to watch some TV. TV. You're going to select Blue TV, and it's, going to, load, and it's, and it's going, going to start stream. streaming, and channels will appear. If you notice, it says all 1611. That means there's 1611 channels. It's important to use the buttons on your remote control. You have a back button, you have an OK button, and you have a home button. you're using your remote control to navigate, you're going to use the button of the left of the OK button to go between all of the categories. You will use the OK button to select. So you can select OK to see the channel list. You can use the left arrow, up arrow, the down arrow to navigate around. If you hold down the OK button, you will create a favorite. When you create a favorite, you're able to pull up those channels as opposed to going through all 16 
111 channels. Another thing to notice is how many channels you can see under the regional locals. Those are typically your news channels. Using your remote to surf around and see the different channels is very important so that you can find baseball, if you will, football, pay-per-view. You can search and find different stations. You can favorite them and when your team comes on, you can watch. I recommend as far as baseball is concerned to go through all the local TV stations like NBC Bay Area, MLB will have stations playing local games that you can access. Look in the sports networks for local stations. You'll be surprised. You'll see more of the games there sometimes than MLB. Now it's time for a video on demand. All right, now we're at the movies and TV series. Very easy to understand. You're gonna go through, you'll see the newest movies, the latest movies, TV series. You're able to watch them and navigate through your remote. When you use your remote control, you're going to use the, the back button, upper right. You'll use the OK button. You'll use the left arrow, right arrow, up arrow, and down arrow to navigate. When you want to watch a TV series, for instance, you'll go to the TV series section, and you go down to TV section. You can go through all of the genres. You can also look at the top right, and you'll see it says page number, and it'll tell you how many are in the entire library. In this case, it's 243. That's 243 times 12. You can do the math. You can use this remote to search if you like for your favorite series or movie. Once you find your series or movie and you're going to watch it, in some cases, like for instance, The Bear, and have season two. You click on season two, move your arrow down, and you can pick the episode to watch. And it will come on and you can watch it. So don't forget, you can watch YouTube and these other services on the box. You can even sign in and it'll remember you. And don't forget playback. You have seven days of playback. You can watch news channels, series, all from this section. You pick the date and time, and you can watch it back. It's for seven days.
using the playback button is a very good way to catch the highlights of the baseball game you may have missed and you didn't want to wait for ESPN. We have even included a list of all the channels. We made a video of all the channels for you to look at. We hope you found this video insightful and helpful. For all your promotional items and needs, please go to 2 bpromocom and over to nepromo.com. Have a good day.